Hello everyone, now uh, welcome back to my channel and in this video we are going to discuss a very simple topic which is uh, setting up a password expiration policy on the accounts. So uh, password expiration policy basically helps you uh, as an organization that you actually ask your users to reset the password in every uh, three months or maybe 120 days or maybe 90 days. So it's upon the requirement that how much days you want uh, the users to reset their passwords or change their passwords. So uh, let's go to Office 365 Admin Center and then let's open Settings and then uh, let's go to Organization Settings and in the Organization Setting we have this Security and Privacy option. So let's come here and after this let's look for Password Expiration Policy. So this is the password expiration policy option we have. I just open it, okay. And the moment I open it, it says uh, set password to ne never expires. I mean, the password will not expire uh, uh, any time, okay, for the users. But I want that in every 30 days or in every 90 days, I want the users to change their passwords, okay, just for security reasons. And, uh, in here, you can put up a value between 14 and 730 days, which is two years. Okay. So I want that the users change their password in every 30 days. Okay. So once I am done with the days selection, okay, I just click on save. The moment I click on save. Okay. So uh, the users won't receive any sort of notifications or anything that uh, their password is going to expire. Okay. Uh, it's just that whatever the application they are using, they will need to re-log in in order to use it again. Okay, once the password uh, uh, is expired and once the pa they change the password. Okay, however, if you are syncing your accounts with your local Active Directory, then you could have uh, multiple option setups like sending notifications in every uh, 30 days or uh, sending notification uh, before five days of expiration so there uh, these sort of uh, settings you can set up but uh, you need to have active directory set up for this okay so now i have set the days to 30 okay this is the time i want the users to change their password i'll just click on save so the moment i click on save the setting is applied to my tenant okay and within 30 days the user will need to change their password so that they can uh, continue their work or they can access their account. Okay, so like I said, today's topic is very simple and uh, that's it for today's video. And uh, if you have any concerns or anything, do let me know in the comment box. And if you like the content, so please like, share and subscribe to my channel. So see you in the next video. Till then, happy learning. Goodbye.